bringing you the play-by-play, and I have a special guest with me, leader of BKS, website hq.bks.ca, and teamspeak, ts3.bks.ca, Starchild. Starchild, are you excited for this match? Oh, uh, yes, I guess, yes. <laughs> uh, especially because uh, today... Uh, the ELH team is bringing a short range drop list. Uh, it's quite a surprise for me, actually. I mean, yeah, uh, looks like they, uh, their available asset list uh, lacked some uh, good uh, uh, long range stuff, so they had to choose a short range uh, uh, drop list for this map, which is. Uh, a very very long range uh, map so it will be way way more interesting so yeah I'm more than excited well it's also interesting because regardless of range this is a pretty cold map and so you can run those heat sinks pretty hard before they start to overheat so they might be able to use some brawl brawling assets but group fire their way through it playing That's... in a Let's see what uh, I am checking. Oh, they started. They started. Okay. Clock's let on. Let me check there. Oh, instead the the attackers brought a very very long range drop list. I see Burner, the leader of the attacker, uh, in a PPC Euler. No, maybe it's a large. Yeah, it's a large laser Euler. Uh, Ivan uh, in an awesome prime, so he got very good range. Proxima is in the Avatar B, the flying red, three ER large lasers and five ER mediums. Uh, Pilvas uh, looks uh, like he's in a Raven uh, with uh, ER large lasers and three medium lasers and SRM2. And uh, Baya looks to be in a Aras Prime. One other oh, asset yeah. in this game with an SRM2 other than the BA. Ah, uh, <laughs> it is a rare weapon. Yeah, indeed, SRM2 is very rare. It looks like uh, they've sent Django out as their scout. He's yeah, way yeah. out there. Where is him? Where is him? Along okay. the edge of the map there in the in the Black Lantern. Now he's headed back. Yeah, which edge? <laughs> this one. Uh, 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 <laughs> thanks. Oh, there. They're getting close to each other. And it is da it is oh, dangerous. Uh, wait, that. Wait, wait, wait. Let me let me check the the drop listings. The ELH drop list. Okay, I see it's Zoidberg in a Shadowcat Bravo, Bob in a Chimera Alpha PPC and small laser. I am uh, in the Hollander with uh, UAC twenty. Caught. Uh, uh, it's uh, Thor with a uh, heavy large laser. And uh, Ghost Rival, or Bravo, or Thor Foxtrot, Thor Foxtrot LBX20, and V74 got um, Thanatos with uh, UAC20 and Flamers and SRMs. Oh, we have first contact. Oh, Burner okay. fires off lasers and oh, machine they're guns. They're really close to each other. Any really type of range advantage they had just went out the window unless they are able to reposition. Seems that uh. We're trying to focus on Bob at the moment with uh, Ivan getting off some long shots there, and now they're backing up. Yeah, they rush at them very, very quickly. Ivan is in. Ivan so is in the range of just about every mech out there. Proxima's that, gonna try and take some of the heat off of him. That awesome is very, very slow. They uh, even need some cover from uh, his teammates uh, if he wants uh, to. At least survive. Looks like Zoidberg's gonna press the issue yeah, here and. Aimbe, Aimbe is on uh, Ivan. Burner's taking Ooh. some pretty good shots here. Yeah, uh, ACQ is not going to damage them a lot. Oh, Django! Oh, wait, no, no, that's my yard. Okay, it looks like that we're splitting up. They're splitting up here. They're encircling and shooting just about everything they can see. Burner is in a bad spot here, and uh, Andro's yeah. taking some pretty good hits here as well. And there goes oh, Burner, and that Burner really does not help to lose your team lead in the uh, middle of the beginning of the match, Star. Yeah, it's, I mean, Ivan, uh, I think that Ivan 
can hold the team right now, but... Oh! Well, considering rocket. that he's got five different mechs on him, I don't know how long he's going to yeah. be in charge. He's already done. They're really spread out right now. Proxima and Bayard yeah. have got to be a good 600 meters from each other. Yeah. This is just about over, I think. Yeah. This yeah. is incredible. Battle mechs are dangerous machines, Starchild, but it is rare that you see a match go this quickly, this fast. Both teams met, and they just concentrated firepower, and I think that's that's the story here, Stars, that they just knew what they wanted to shoot and knew... Oh, Jan look. Oh, Janko just came. Look. Uh, a bit late. Yep, they, they got down NV-74, but I don't know if that's going to be enough to turn it around with uh, Bayard down now. I mean, Django, why did Django leave the team? He was, the team? he, he yeah, is in a Django. scout mech. Yeah, but, uh, uh, think he got too, too far uh, out? Yeah, probably too far, yeah. He's That's gonna run now, Andros got the uh, range on him. Well, Django has no problems because he can turn. He's well, so, yeah. he's allowing Proxima plenty of time to reposition here if he desires. I mean, four oh, mechs Proxima, chasing. Uh, he's still alive. That's true. Yep. And he's making the best he can. And Avatar is not exactly fast. Even the Flying Red uh, doesn't live up to its name as a uh, as a quick well, asset. It's uh, well, it's Jan Jets actually help uh, help sometimes. So they're they can be really useful. But, and uh, you know, and it looks like I the, mean. And, it can jump, uh, I mean, it can move faster sometimes, especially uh, oh, especially on this map because of the low gravity, but it uh, looks like, uh, anyway, it looks like it's... Getting... Looks like they kind of realized what Django was trying yeah. to force them to do, and they've decided to focus on Proxima yeah. by far the more uh, uh, dangerous alive, asset here. Ooh, got a hit on Bob. Well, those, some of those mechs are going to take damage because even in a one-sided explosive fest like we just saw, ladies and gentlemen, uh, you oh, wait, still... Wait, wait. Cut this, cut this damn... Oh, Aimba lost. Oh, Aimba is down. Django took down Aimba. Wow. Well, this could savage. get interesting depending on how much Indeed. damage Proxima has taken. Oh. But still, that's a, that's a Thor, that's a Owens, that's a... Yeah. Proxima is going to... Oh, wait! He got... He took down uh, Anki's arm. Well, interesting. Uh, He's gonna have to take care of Zoidberg to pull this off. Hot's moving up quickly. Tors, it's Tors, so it means he's really, really damaging. Yeah. But it's still alive. It's still Pro alive. Proxima can deal out enough dan... Well, it's still four mechs, but... Yeah. I've seen stranger things, ladies Django, and gentlemen. Django is uh, shooting a cut. Uh-oh. There is oh cut this down oh my god cut this down do we have an upset in the works ladies and gentlemen let's find out uh pro nope. proxima proxima is down Les Django's gonna pull oh, off a Muhammad Ali it. here <laughs> I, I I I think this uh, is just about finished and, and it is, Django is down. Uh, it was really really interesting and so the defenders take the map yep and we'll see you on uh the next edition of Chaos March TV. For now, for Star Child and myself, goodbye everybody.